All right, let's take a couple minutes and talk about how to use the Fix Elbow Robot for tennis elbow and golfer's elbow treatment. Now, both conditions, you start with emollient, you put a little bit on the outside for tennis elbow and a little bit on the inside for golfer's elbow. The robot itself is heavy. It's designed for arms of all sizes, but I always start with a pillow to support it. It might take two or three or four therapies to get real comfortable, but once you find the right spot, you'll know it. All right, let's tackle tennis elbow first. So now that you've put emollient on the outside of your arm, you've located that bony protrusion where the tendon attaches to the elbow. So what you're gonna want is the scraping blades on the bottom of the machine as they come around that pulley. You're gonna want them to start right after that bone. So I take the robot, you turn it on with a button on the bottom side. I grab my pillow and then I just slide my arm in so that the arm strap lines up with the crease in my elbow. That's a great starting point. And then I just kind of slide the machine so that it's sitting on its side. And then you hit play to start your therapy. Now there's two ways that you can increase or decrease the intensity of the therapy. You take the arm strap and you can pull it tighter to make it a deeper therapy or you can loosen it if it's too intense. Then the second thing that you can do is you can make a fist and you can manipulate your wrist and what that does is it flexes those muscles and tendons so it'll make it more intense. When I do that, I'll typically hold, my, hold a fist for 30 seconds and then I'll release for 30 seconds. There are three keys to the fixed elbow program. The first one is follow the program. It is a full eight weeks. Don't overdo it, don't underdo it. The second one is find the right spot on your arm. So grab your pillow, find the right chair, find the right couch. It might take you a couple therapies to really get comfortable with it, but once you find the spot, you'll know it. And then the third one is if your pain increases, which is totally normal, continue with the therapy. You can decrease the intensity of the robot or the stretching, but continue on with the treatment. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out. All right, now let's talk about the fixed elbow robot and golfer's elbow. So the technique is a little different here because on the tennis elbow side, the tendon protrudes so it's easy to get to. On the golfer's elbow side, the tendon is recessed behind the forearm muscle and the bony protrusion, the medial epicondyle. So the technique's a little different, but once you find the right spot, it's, it's fantastic. So what I do is I grab my pillow, I grab the robot, you turn the robot on with the power button on the bottom side, and then what I do is I place it face down on the pillow in front of me. The other thing that I've done is I make sure that the arm strap is loose so that I can slide my arm back and forth, and then I can control the position by moving my arm instead of moving the machine. So I slide my arm in, well first I hit start, so I have the machine going, and as the uh, the, the scraping blades come around that pulley, I want them to engage with that tendon. But to start, I haven't hit my forearm, so I only put my arm in part way, and then as those scraping blades are coming around, I'll work my arm in so that it comes around and then it's right after where that bone is. Then from there, I can control the intensity by pushing down, and I actually push down more with my elbow than my forearm, and sometimes I'll lift my forearm up a little bit so that I'm really focused in this area where the tendon is. So that's the first way to change the intensity is by pushing down. The second way is, just like with tennis elbow, you can make a fist and then you can manipulate your wrist. And what that does is that flexes the muscles and tendons in the forearm, which will increase the intensity. Now when I do that, I typically do it for 30 seconds where I'll make a fist and then I'll relax for 30 seconds and just kind of do an interval throughout the therapy. Now when you start, you start with five minutes for the first treatment and then you go to 10 minutes for every treatment after that. There are three keys to the Fix Elbow Program. The first one is follow the program. It is a full eight weeks. Don't overdo it, don't underdo it. The second one is find the right spot on your arm. So grab your pillow, find the right chair, find the right couch. It might take you a couple therapies to really get comfortable with it, but once you find the spot, you'll know it. And then the third one is if your pain increases, which is totally normal, continue with the therapy. You can decrease the intensity of the robot or the stretching, but continue on with the treatment. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out.